the last two years, we have lost many stars in 2020 and 2021. This lockdown in the wake of the corona pandemic has turned out to be a deeply painful story for the Kannada film industry. And now, Sanchari Vijay. Hi, Yalargo Namaskara. June 12th, Vijay was riding along with his friend Naveen on the bike. The actor's motorcycle skidded on Saturday, 12th June at around 11.30 near JP Nagar, Bangalore when he was returning home from his friend's place. As per the report, actor was returning after distributing ration kits to the needy people. Vijay hit his head on the electric pole, causes a serious head injury, immediately was taken to an Apollo hospital and moved to an ICU where a surgery was performed to remove hemorrhage from his brain. June 14, a doctor was quoted as saying he had a blood clot in the brain. We had performed the surgery. The next 48 hours are going to be critical. A CT scan of Vijay's brain reported showing very severe brain injury. Monday night, 8.20 p.m. Doctor again stated, Mr. Vijay's apnea test were performed at 12.25 p.m. and 7.50 p.m. today and are found to be positive. June 15, 3.45 a.m. Apollo Hospital announced at 3.45 a.m. on June 15 that the actor had passed away. The entire Apollo Hospital extended a heartly console with the family. A medical statement issued by neurosurgeon Dr. Arun Yel Naik. Actor's family had decided to donate his organs to keep a new life to many. His body was kept for public viewing between 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. in Ravindra Kalakshetra. He was cremated with a full state police honor, with brother Sidesh performing the last rituals. Vijay Kumar Baswarajaya, popularly known by his stage name Sanchari Vijay. He was born in 1983 in Rangapura, Kadur Taluk of Karnataka's Chikmangalur district. He spent his childhood in the neighboring village of Panchanahalli, Chikmangalur in Karnataka. His father was Baswarajaya and his mother Gaurama. And he has the two siblings, elder brother Virupaksha and younger brother Siddesh. When I say Sanchari Vijay, you will first remember National Award. He's also one of the star roles to fame who have truly shown the worth and are the definition of being self-made. From a middle class family and grew up believing that he and his brother needs to study harder to get a job after his mother's death, who was suffering from a severe jaundice. Sanchari Vijay subsequently moved to Bangalore and started working in a cafe Malnad in Bangalore to earn his money and also to support his brother's education. Both the brothers were the only hope for each other. After graduating with a Bachelor of Engineering degree, he started joining different drama theatres to learn acting and started performing on different stages. And finally, he ended up joining Sanchari Theatre, a cultural centre and a unique theatre for talented artists. And he took up stage acting professionally. Even after giving several auditions, up to 70 to 80 auditions were failed. Gradually, he started questioning himself and his acting skills. He never lost hope and he always believed and one fine day he will be a successful star. Sanchari Vijay made his debut with the film Ranga Bahog Bitta in 2011 and he got a small role in Rama Rama Ragurama before he received a massive recognition for his performance in Daswala. And many media houses started covering him and started appreciating his work. Sanchari Vijay got a massive breakthrough with the movie Aribu, directed by Manjunatha Soma Keshwaredi. This movie was inspired by a true incident. Aribu won 62nd National Award for the Best Kannada Film from the Directorate of Film Festival, the Best Movie of Karnataka State Award for the year 2014 under the Best Production and Direction category. Nanu Avalalla Avan, his role of a transgender person won him the Best Actor Award at National Film Award, Living Smile Vidya's autobiography, which also fledged him his first national award. With the award win, Vijay became the third actor after M.V. Vasudev Rao and Charu Hasan to win the national award for the Best Actor 
performing in a Kannada film. Even many legends in the popular actor from the industry Darshan Yash Sudeep Puneet Rajkumar started praising his acting skills and talent. Sanchari Vijay Ori Datta Golkide. Baala Dondu Nata Ante Ilti Nona. Ekare Nana Onda Nana Onda Nona 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 He also received the Karnataka State Film Awards for Best Actor and the Film Critics Awards for the Best Actor South and also he received a lot of praise and appreciation for his performance in Killing Me Gently and in a career span of 10 years he appeared in 25 films. Vijay was last seen in the act 1978 which was the first Kannada movie to be released in theaters after lockdown and two of his movie Attukuntu Lekka Killa and Meloba Mayavi are scheduled to release. but it is written in stone death as a part of life but sudden death at any age the loss and the pain can strike very deeply